everyone. Hope everyone is doing well and having a wonderful day. I just wanted to come in and share with you guys my newest plant. This is my first Hoya. My first ever. I've never grown Hoyas before and I have started to admire them. Um, and this is a Hoya Ruberia Carnosa, I believe. I'll put the actual description name in the description bar below and at the bottom of this video you should see it there too. Um, this one is a variegated one, and I guess you can say I'm a bad plant mommy. <laughs> I found out that Hoyas are very much uh, like, ha, um, excuse me, like orchids. So they're not too fussy. A lot of people think orchids are very fussy, but they're not. Um, so this Hoya, I actually mail ordered it, and I've actually had it for about two or three weeks now. And yes, that's terrible because I have yet to plant it. It came with this little ball of soil, which was so great of the seller to send that to me. So what I've been doing is just watering that sporadically here and there. And since then, in the, the two weeks or so that I've had it, it has grown a whole set, if I can get it up, a whole set of leaves, whoops, of leaves, these two little delicate leaves there and then if you can see let's see if I can show you uh, it's growing another pair there below it right there so uh, yeah I love the Hoya leaves because they do remind me of a peperomia where the leaves are sort of like a succulent in the sense that they're soft and shiny not soft as in fuzzy but like you can feel like moisture in them because they're sort of thick and rubbery like and so I like that about it I like that it it trails um, and that it grows and as it grows this one sort of has like a pink tint and as you can see the stem is pink and so I believe that this Hoya will bloom white flowers with like a pink center if not if I'm not incorrect um, but I hear it takes a while for it to mature to bloom so, um, until then, I'm so glad that it has the beautiful variegated foliage with the white and the green. I absolutely love that. And I just look forward to having this in my collection. So, I'm going to pot it. I think I am going to keep this yellow pot. I'm going to disinfect it. I just sat it in there so that it could have some stability. And I have it in a full sun window. And so, it seemed to be doing very, very well there. So, uh, stay tuned. And I, I guess I will give you guys an update. If you want a full plant video haul of my indoor plants, comment below and let me know um, if that's something that you guys would be interested in. And then one day I can take the time and, and just go around and show you all the plants that I currently have in my indoor collection. Alright, so thank you so much for watching. Until next time, as always, show love and kindness. And I love you guys. Uh, and take care. And Hope to hear from you with the comments. Until the next video, bye!